The Godzilla vs. Kong version of Mechagodzilla is by far one of the most powerful titans of all time. Outside of King Ghidorah, it is the second biggest titan we have seen in the MonsterVerse. We saw just how powerful it was during the fight with Godzilla and Kong. Although they were not necessarily at full health, it still takes a lot of abilities to overpower them, especially in a 2 vs. 1 battle. And I do think there is an interesting question that does pertain to the other Titans in the MonsterVerse. We know that they were in hibernation during this film, and that was mainly due to the revival of King Ghidorah in the form of Mechagodzilla. The question is, what would the battle be like if Titans like the Behemoth, Scylla, Methuselah, Skullcrawlers, and Rodan were in the mix? Could all of these Titans truly take down Mechagodzilla? Well, first off, we all saw how one-sided the Skullcrawler fight was. Despite that, though, the Skullcrawlers have never been solo fighters. Although we saw the big one fight Kong in a 1 vs 1, every single battle up until that point was a pack fight. The initial war on Skull Island was a whole army of Skullcrawlers. Then, even in Kong Skull Island, we saw a Kong fight two at once. They were getting dominated, but they were not fully grown. If we want to use a pack of fully grown skull crawlers and make them fight Mecha Godzilla, they would have a far better chance. That's as long as they all attack at once. Like I said, it's the same thing with their fights with Kong. If you made a battle dome and you had Kong in there and a skull crawler, of course Kong is going to win any one versus one. He is now fully grown, and he would defeat all of them. However, let's say there are five massive skull crawlers. The battle would then become a lot more even. However, when it would come to the other Titans fighting Mechagodzilla, they would have to move very well and very fast, and pretty much try their best to not get hit by that red atomic breath. Godzilla took that beam, but we already know how durable he is. And there are Titans like the Behemoth that do have fire-resistant fur. Also, Rodan has historically taken Godzilla's atomic breath very well. So, although Apex's version of this attack is much different, these Titans can take this strike much better than the Skullcrawler did. Even though the Skullcrawlers are powerful creatures, they were never really that that durable. The main thing though with these other titans is the speed. With Mechagodzilla having that power source in his hands, these titans will have to be very quick to dodge that. Godzilla and Kong are very quick and they don't walk on all fours, and even they got hit by these strikes. So when it does come to a fight like this, I do think these titans have a path to victory. However, they will have to attack all at once. If Mechagodzilla gets a 1 vs 1 style, then this mechanized titan will defeat them. For all of you though, what do you think about this? How would the other Titans fare against Mechagodzilla in a pack battle? Write all of your opinions down below, and if you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like and subscribe if you want.